In this tip of the week, we will look at the use of pages to introduce students to course content and activities in my classes. Whether you are supplementing your traditional course or designing an online or hybrid course, the use of pages can help guide students to the various content and activities related to the course. In our example today, we will use pages to create a module introduction for week 8 in a hybrid course and to provide easy access to various content and activities. Let's begin by adding a week 8 overview page to the week 8 module. Click the plus icon to the right of the module title. From the add item box, change the selection to content page. Select New Page, type Week 8 Overview, and click Add Item. Now that the page is created and associated with the module, click on the title and edit to begin creating your page. Begin by placing the information you want displayed on the page. In our example, we are listing the activities the students are to engage in. To help further guide the students, we can quickly link to other existing elements of the course. We will use the right side links to create a link to students to access related videos, which is using another content page, to the weekly online discussion, and to the weekly notes and connections assignment. You may have noticed that students are asked to read an article from 2001. However, you want to include a more recent article on strategic reading available in our library da databases. One of the best methods of providing access to an article is to use the library research and a static URL or permanent link to the full text article and citation. To begin, at the library homepage, enter the search for the article. And locate the desired article. Click View Now to see the availability. Once you have located the full text version of the article, use the following strategy to add this to your course. First, select the Cite option on the right. Select the desired citation format and then copy the citation. Paste this citation within your page. Then locate the permanent link to the article. Copy the URL. Then select the title of the article and click on the link icon and paste the link into this text box. However, don't click insert link quite yet. Select the home key on your keyboard to go to the beginning of the URL. To ensure that students can access the article when they are off campus, we need to add an additional URL to the beginning of the link. This additional URL is https colon slash slash proxy hyphen su dot researchport dot umd dot edu slash login question mark URL equal. Once this is added to the beginning of the URL, you can select insert link and then click save. You can test the link by clicking on the link and have it open in a new window. For more information on locating and linking articles and other library resources, please contact your library liaison. 
On our Week 8 overview, you might have noticed that we had an additional page in our module for Week 8 videos. Let's edit this page and embed a video on strategic reading. Place your insertion point where you want the video to be. Then on the toolbar, click on the Public Resources icon. It looks like three stacked books. Select YouTube and then search for the related content. Once you have located the video, select Embed Small to add the video to the page. Then click Save. Students can then review the video directly within the My Classes course. Thank you for watching this tip of the week. For more information, please review the following resources.